It's summertime. So I've made some videos about this, but didn't talk specifically about something that got me really good last week. And I, the reality is this, I, I've, I've really let a lot of this stuff just be, you know? With the Cuyahoga County and Cleveland, uh, Cuyahoga County Children and Family Services. But I, I, really, I really don't care, but I don't know, something, I, 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 was, I can sleep last week. What's today, the 10th or something, 11th of July, 2019? I'm pretty sure it's the 10th. So this video is specifically, you know, my love for Johanna, the Benson family, um, they do what they do, and I am who I am, okay? Whatever they're doing, they're doing, and they, what they've done, and that's on them, all right? Some things came back to me. Look, I know people who work at Children and Family Services, Cuyahoga County, right there in downtown Cleveland. So stuff gets back to me. And, well, look, me, obviously, I've been sexually active with many women, 2018, 2019. They do this, like, this swap thing, okay? And, you know, most of, nah, I don't know, I, I, I can't, a lot of the girls were hearing, you know, that are, they had to do that because, this is back in 2013. Um, for my situation, and of course Jennifer, which I love her very much. I, I like these girls, you know, Johanna, I, 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 I committed my life to them, you know, in marriage. Um, these swabs to determine if, to paternity, serious? In mo you know, both cases, I said, are you guys serious? The law in Ohio is, you don't even need to do this stuff. But, I, whatever the motive was, you know, they're, they're Better client, I'm a client, they're a client, they're both clients, I guess, this kind of stuff. I'm gross, by the way. I mean, when I had, a, you know, that woman swabbing me, trying to sign that I'm one of her clients. Wow. <laughs> this stuff is really, it's, it's not funny, but it's like, it's its easy stuff to, to, to deal with if, if you just be cool, you know? Anyway. Yeah, we did the swab thing. And I, I sent a letter, I communicated, and I was actually in the office when Johanna called and talked to a woman, a separate woman than the woman who did the swab, and, and we were talking, no, hey, they, they want, them. like, as though we were sleeping around or something. Like, we didn't know who for sure was the father. Are you serious? I'm the father of Jason, Haven, Ruby, Levi, Lydia, and then, of course, with Jennifer, Ava. I guess she had another one. I'm the father, and it's, I don't, I don't even need to do a paternity test, I, I never needed to. They, were well, the first case, I, how, how these things could even end up in those places in the first place, they have no jurisdiction, but. <laughs> um, you're hearing it directly on this one video dedicated just to, you know, what happened, oh, yeah, I got some information from people last week. Um, it, by the way, it's been like raining, so you, you know, today's being Wednesday, so Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, pretty much all day. That's how it is, you know, in the summertime down here. And, and anywhere, it's like, you know, Florida, except for the Panhandle, really. Of course, we got some tropical storms coming in this weekend, and that'd be kind of fun. I'm watching the, you know, clouds, like, it's gonna start raining, I might have to run in a little bit. Or I got a little, little, little thing right here, too. Isn't that cool? I love this little playground here. So, um, the things that are said about this Middleton family, by the way, in, in, in that Children and Family Services, you know, Cuyahoga County, there's truly like two people who are like at the top of the list who are known. Sean Kemp, he's got like nine or ten or something children, maybe like 14 or 15, I don't know, and they all like, a lot of them went through there, you know, he played for the Cavs, of course. So he got, he had like multiple women and like, anyway, and of course me, you know. <laughs> so, I've, my, 
five children with Johanna, which I've always declared, and you don't even need, you know, it's, to even do, and that's really, I mean, who does something like that, seriously? It was not me, okay, I didn't need to, I got, I got material proof, I told him. That's law, you don't need to, you know, do a swab if you just sign an affidavit and I had it, you know. Huh. Cuyahoga County Children and Family Services is a disaster. Go to the building, front, each side, you know, superior side and then the other, and reverse side. It's a, I mean, you got girls, it's like they're literally selling themselves. They're get, they're offering guys four, five hundred, maybe three hundred, I don't know, four or five hundred dollars just so that they would have, that they would have sex because they want to get paper. You can, you can, you're literally, you're, you're getting five hundred dollars a month in welfare. They call it paper. They want your paper. Why they want the paper? It's drugs. And you can't say that. And I know people, I, I, I talked to, um, a lot, well, obviously James Brown, I've mentioned him. I think it was a, Angela or Pamela Bass, B-A-S-S. -S. There's, there's an Angela and a Pamela as well. I just went, went, I'm not sure, you know. Uh, I've talked to a lot of people over there, obviously. Every, I mean, every single time I've been there, I've been there. I've been there a dozen, well, more than a dozen times, not dozens. Probably less than 20 times, um, you know, since 2013. Every time I've been there, you, you, everybody smell. More than half the people smell like alcohol, that they're, they're uh, us, the clients, or drugs, pot, okay? I know what pot smells like. Lucky me, right? I am clean, and I always have been and always will be. And that's what this is about, drugs, you know? And, and... not parenting our children the way they need to be loved and cherished and served. I mean, the reality is, is I, I, I've come to the conclusion and acceptance, really the acceptance, I don't know, was it 2017, 2018? Yeah, right in there. Really, 2018. That that whole organization is, and it's it's led by the governor. They appoint, you know, the director there in Columbus. And I've talked to people in Columbus as well on High Street. That's like you know oversees all the different counties ones. You know, um, you got wicked, nasty outrageous governors, you know, um, I'm checking that time here, John Kasich, and then of course now you got Mike DeWine. Do you realize, folks, that under Mike DeWine's administration, they've had 700, listen, 700 missing children, and they're, most of them are coming from this kind of, you know, situation. I mean, if you got a few that are just a little mess, who are raised by mommy and daddy, but yeah, typically, you know, single parent homes. Um, I, I've talked to so many people over at that Cuyahoga County one, but if, if I was governor, oh my God, you know, I'd freak out. You got seven missing children in all of Ohio. Seven, more than 700. Look it up. It's one of the leaders in the country. There's no excuse for this. I like the wine is, is you know, he himself is a drunk. You gotta have, you know, oh, you know, uh, talk about that you know, when you're working. You can't, you know, people have been actually, susp I know people have been suspended for that. Oh, these girls are coming in for paper to buy papers, you know, cash. Because they get the food cards in the back. <laughs> I guess they had this food, and I've actually heard that they take, they, 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 um, they call it EBT cards, or like they can, food stamps. They used to have food stamps. My mom had food stamps in the 80s. You know, they the stores would, would stamp these things, but now they have actual cards. But guess what? You can't buy drugs with the cards. So, yeah, the guys would make comments, or girls would make comments, and they get suspended just for saying that, which I, I know, I, I'm with that, I hear that, but... Most of this is drugs, okay? Absolute lowlifes. Um, I accept the fact, though, that, you know, our, 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 
our society is the way it is, and women have been trained to be little slaves to sell their bodies for cash, and it's really big in Cleveland, Ohio. And of course, you got the police. I'm, you know, I've, I've talked to the police about this. I got some serious issues with regard to tampering, um, perjury. They say they can, you know, these people can threaten me however they want. I've been threatened. I, I've had enough of it. I'm out of it, guys. Okay, and it, it really got intense in 2016. I was going over there and talking to various people, trying to find other ways in to talk to these people. Why? Why? Why am I putting so much effort into talking to these people when they, they want nothing? They've never, I mean, hearings? They're supposed to do hearings. I, I actually had a few hearings in, in my Jennifer Loggins case. Huh? But again, they, they just didn't, you know, you, you can see the docket. There's actually a docket for that. But not for Johanna. I, I, you know, they, they found a way to seal it better. Maybe they changed the rules or something, but yeah, you know, but I mean, just, you know, I've heard of situations whereby, like, food carts, for example, okay, there's a lot of workers, are, they're not being paid, but, you know, 15 bucks an hour. They're buying these food carts, and instead of the actual, like, employee of Children and Family Service in Cuyahoga County using it, they sell it themselves, and, you know, for a little bit less, then, you know, more, but less than what they would use for and to somebody else. Like you got, like they got $194, I guess. Almost, yeah, like $194. They made me pay like 90 bucks for it, and then they turn around and sell it to somebody else for 150 or something, make my money on it. They get enough of these people. They're, they're, they're screwing all these girls too, y'all. Ask around. I mean, they they, 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 get the, they see the phone numbers right there. Call them, you know, star or whatever it was. So they don't see the number. Hey, I saw you in, you know, let's, let's hang out. This place is a dump, and they're really using these girls. Oh, God. I have, no, never supported this stuff. My children have had more than they've ever needed. <laughs> oh, wait, but we can see the videos, you know. Pictures. And... It's not me, y'all. I mean, we, my, you know, Johanna and I, we were together, just me and her, never apart. I love her so much, so sweet. For more than eight hours, maybe like twice, one time in Florida, I went up to uh, Gainesville while they stayed, all the babies and Johanna stayed back in um, Kissimmee, and then maybe two other times, but never you know, apart, y'all, it was just me and her, so... And obviously, I'm talking about how I'm polyamorous, and I've accepted that, 2017. And I'm talking about accepting that, you know, I'm just not going to, I'm not going to get anywhere with these, these, they're just dangerous people, okay? They're really, it's a nice breeze, it's like 90 degrees right now. I'm going to show you the sky, just to see how funny it is, okay? Like, it's totally, it's getting totally, like, cleared up right now, but way over there, look over there. I mean, these, these, we get these, like, mini hurricanes that we do all the time. Right around, like, the first of, like, right around Memorial Day weekend, right? And, like, the wind is no more than 20 miles per hour. Sometimes it's as low as zero, seriously. But just a lot of rain, you know? Huh. Where am I going to go here? <laughs> yeah, they're just very disrespectful people. Um... You know, just some people you just, I mean, look, I, I, I always been really kind, and nice, and gentle, and friendly. Look, I say, I understand how our society is. Drugs is running rampant, and the government, maybe it's not funded enough. I don't know what the situation is. You know, I, I can blame the, the police and task force all I want, but it's going on and on, you know? And that's what these people are going there, they're selling their bodies for drugs. You can see it right outside. The, the employees of these children and family services, they, they go right outside and they smoke. Talk to them. I've talked to these people. They're, they're not there to be peaceful people. They're not happy with their jobs. So yeah, they're buying, they're, buy, they're dealing drugs. They're actually dealing, they're getting, you know, drugs for these girls. And I say girls, it's like 97, 8% the statistics show. You know, for Cuyahoga County, for example, as, as this one right here is all ghetto, by the way. It's, it's, it's severe, so ghetto, it's ghetto. 
So I've made videos, I've, I've written about it on my blog and on Facebook, but it's been like in, mixed in. This one is specifically about this specific issue with regard to paternity, the swab. We didn't need it. I've always, I got material Purdue. I've always, I, I love my babies. And what I'm going to say now is that all organizations, all agencies, yeah, all of Ohio, starting yeah with Calgary County, they're gonna, they're gonna. I mean, I understand that they, they're gonna, they don't want shared parenting, which is what the new rule is. Fine, so be it. I'm just letting, nice. Um, that's that's fine. They want to have it that way. That's that's great. That's that's how they're gonna do it. They don't want to, you know, have hearings. That's great. I I respect that. I honor that. Transparency. They're gonna have it because of me. I'm talking about in my situation. We're going to have full transparency, but most importantly, they're going to be... Oh, pretty bird. They declare in every possible way, confessing that my children, Jason, Haven, Ruby, Levi, Lydia, Ava, and obviously Michaela, similar situation. I'm going to talk more about this in this, you know, uh, this situation with regard to all my life and how this has happened like so many times. <laughs> uh, it's me, okay? But anyway are to reside with me, where they're happiest, safest. Anybody, I mean, the thing is, any, any, anybody that goes to that welfare thing, they're declaring that they're, in, they're, they're not suitable to be a parent. <laughs> Hello? But I get, fine, you don't really care, you know, you know you're financially incapable. <laughs> wow. And the abuse, I mean, you can just, just look it up. I mean, there's, there's so many lawsuits of Actual murders. They're, they're trying to kill children, y'all. That's what it is. <laughs> That's funny, but it is what it is, and I gotta accept that. They're not about safety and protection and honesty, transparency. No, they're about just look at just look at the record on these people. You shouldn't have one death, not even one. I shouldn't be saying death. Are you serious? I mean, there should be simple. I don't even want to talk about the other stuff. Just for me, you know, my situation. My record, by the way, is perfect. RP 888101. Look it up, baby. It's the best ever. GSX, GXS. GSX 5683. GSX. Can't see it from here, but. <laughs> I'm proud of that. I'm proud of Jennifer and proud of Johanna for having our babies. That's so nice. Wow. I'm proud of my children. And that we're going to be respected and honored in such a way that our bodies are our own. The swabbing is just. Oh, God, are you serious? I mean, I want to take it seriously, though, you know? I did it, and I did it. I did anything they want me to do. So these people want to do it. We're going to get you for trespassing for coming over here. So I mean, that's back in 2013. Wow. They're scared people. Why? They, they know they're committing crimes. But again, it goes back to the DeWine and the, the K-Sick people. They're appointing people, you know, as, as directors who... It's, it's Ohio. It's, it's Oregon, yeah, New Jersey. Um, New York, and obviously Florida is a total disaster down here too, but just to get a hearing is like a miracle I'm hearing from anybody. My, my attorney, one of my attorneys, Bob Aldridge, she said, Jason, just, and I said, well, you know, she's accusing me of abuse, she's accusing me of abuse, and of course I found the papers two years later that there's domestic violence on my, on my, domestic violence, <laughs> me, hey, let me be the most domestic violent man ever, God, if that's domestic violence. Hugs and kisses, <laughs> tackles. Oh yeah, I pitch inside. What's up? Go watch a video. Whip, 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 whip. Tackle hard. Throw our babies up in the air. Through, not through, but like into like the you know, the duct for the not the duct. What do you call it? The trusses <laughs> for the um, cathedral ceilings when they're like six months old. That's fun. Our children never had a a mark except for lips on their cheeks from me and Johanna well yeah we got some sexy marks that's fun the 
they can't answer these things. They can't. How, how, do, how, do, how do they completely avoid people? Well, we know why, you know. They screwed up. I don't think it's just that they screwed up. There's a reason for this stuff, you know. These are serious crimes, y'all. I mean, the alcohol, the drugs, and how the hell? Not just the drugs, but I mean, the girls, the sex. I mean, they're, they're just being passed around by these guys inside. And a lot of them are lesbians that work there, so they're, 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 they're getting the girls, too. And I've been asked about the whole Johanna thing. I haven't had any contact with her, none. I don't know. I mean, I, I don't even involve me with this, guys. I, I, it's gross, y'all. It really is.